Okay, we're gonna make a carbonara. It's, it's egg, guanciale. I don't have guanciale, so I have bacon, um, pasta. Uh, and that's kind of it. It's just egg and bacon and pasta, essentially. So. I have this nice bacon. Um, I don't have like four hands, so I'll show you in a second um, what we're working with here. You know, it's pretty good. I got this stuff from like a nice butcher. Um, I got it. I got some pepper bacon, so it has it has pepper on it. You know, um, so. You know, uh, uh, here here it is. Here's the bacon. I can't flip to my front camera or my, you know. So there's that. Um, I need to get a knife real quick. All right, so you're just gonna cut the bacon into like, I don't know, whatever you want. You know what I mean? However big you want it. Uh, by the way, guanciale is, is pig cheek, you know? That's kind of the classic traditional way. Um, if you don't have that, like pancetta is kind of your next thing, you know, like a slab of like pork belly cured. Um, and then I don't have any of those, so I just got bacon, but it's good bacon. You know, it's not that broke ass bitch bacon. It's nice bacon. Um, you're going to want like two eggs and then an extra egg yolk for this. Cause there's no cream in this you know that extra egg egg makes it real nice and creamy let me grab that um we get a pot i'm gonna pop for some water here it's pretty late right now it's it's uh it is 12 55 um we just had a party my dad's birthday party and uh, I did not get enough because my dad did not buy enough steak for uh, everybody. Which is okay, it'd be like that. I'm just gonna fill up some water here. That's pretty good. Um, okay, that's gonna sit here. Put that bitch on high. Um, gonna get some salt. I'm just gonna get some coarse salt. It's kosher, as God intended. Um, this is the this is the pig. This is the bacon. You know, I have a nice Japanese knife. Big fan. All right, so you really want to make this bit salty? Fuck oil or whatever. Damn, that is not the right side. I want the other side. So this is a brand new thing. Sorry about the dirty kitchen. Uh, my parents are firm believers in dealing with that shit outside of the party. So the next morning, I guess. Um, this is a bunch of orange marmalade that my parents got from Fornham and Mason because they're a bunch of whores for that Fornham and Mason shit. Um, I got this, this thin spaghetti. You want it all Dante because uh, it's gonna finish cooking with the bacon. So, um, really just gonna wait for that to get boiling and then we'll get started on the, uh, the rest of it. All right, so here we are. 
mixing the egg here. So I have two eggs and egg yolk, um, and a third egg yolk, and some parm. And I have some, I have some parmesan, you know. Um, this is this is just the sauce, you know. This is the whole thing. You feel me? So that's pretty good. We'll deal with that later. Um, I'm kind of just waiting for this water to boil, and then we'll get going. Uh, I'm just gonna boil the pasta, get get this this bacon going, create kind of like a lardon, um, and then once the pasta is all dante, I'm gonna add that to where the bacon's gonna be, and then like kind of kind of sit and like and just kind of cook in the juices and the fat that gets rendered out. And then when we then you then you take it off the heat, you'll you know you'll see you'll see. Okay. All right. So the pasta's on, the bacon's in. There's no oil, no butter, no nothing. It's just that's just the bacon fat rendering out. Uh, we're gonna wait for this bitch to get all Dante. So that's like five minutes in there. And, then, and again, this is just the, the two eggs and an egg yolk and Parmesan cheese. And this, you kind of just want to get it real crispy, real nice and crispy. You really want to render all that fat out. Um, you know, this is really, this is a little maybe farther along than I would have liked it. Ow! I'm not wearing a shirt right now and that fucking oil really slapped the shell on my nipple right there. Um... Yeah, I'm probably going to take this off the heat for right now or just put it out real low. Put that bitch on simmer. And then... Kind of just get, get it off the heat for now, you feel me? I really jumped the gun here, which is fine. The, the pasta is really going to soak all that fat up. All that grease up, you know? Huh. I'm, getting, I'm still getting more drunk. Still, uh... What is this? Get here. Ugh. No, is that the Bushmills? Is this the Bushmills Black Bush? Ooh, hello. Oh, yeah. Just gonna get after it a little bit. Ugh. You know, get yourself right for a little cooking action. That's enough left to make it look like I haven't been drinking this. You know what I mean? I mean, I, I think I have some regular Bushmills up in this bitch too. Up there. Ooh, I do. So we're gonna do the, the black bush. Which is okay. I think I like the normal bl uh, the normal bush ones better. We really don't like Irish whiskey that much, but it's like that. Um, we're really just gonna get after it, you know. It's okay. My parents don't drink these ones because Bushmills is for poor people. Um, you know. Yeah, my nipples are low key kind of hard right now. But I'll get back to you when this is done. All right, so this bitch is ready. I may have overcooked it. It's, it's a little bit better. It's a little more done than Al Dante. That's fine. It'd be like that. You want to add it to that bitch. Um, you really want to have this on low heat or no heat. Um, I'm going to have it on low heat just because I, I, I rushed the bacon a little bit. So I got to reheat it a little bit. Um, you really want it on no heat, though, if you're going to do it properly. Because um, you don't want to scramble the eggs. That's the important thing, is that you don't want to... You really don't want to scramble... You know? Because then you just get scrambled eggs, and you're fucking... Uh, and you're fucking carbonara like some sort of loser. Like some sort of... Like some sort of bitch. And, uh, yeah, so you really just want to mix it in there, really get it in there with the oil. You really want to soak it all up. Um, so you get that nice color to it, getting real mixed in with that, that pork fat. 
I mean, when you have that really nice guanciale, which unfortunately I don't have any of right now, but I have had it before. Um, I've been known to keep that bitch around, you know? So I've been doing some pro flips, bro. Uh, all right, so now that that's going, I can really get in there with the, uh, the egg. Um, we'll see if I need two hands for this. I'm thinking I probably will. And I'll regret filming this with one hand. But uh, it happens, you know, if I get scrambled eggs. You really don't want that kind of stuff. Um, so there's that. There's, there's the creaminess of the sauce. You really want that extra yolk in there. Um, it's kind of, it's kind of key here. And like having a little bit of that pasta water, that starch, make it really coat that pasta up, you know? I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna just gonna turn that off. Um, cause you really don't want, uh, you know, you really don't want scrambled eggs, which looks kind of what I'm getting here. I'm pretty drunk right now, so the fact that I can even put this together is pretty good. I, uh, I fell down the stairs getting down here, so, you know. Um, this is, uh, this is a pretty big success for me, you feel me? Um, and then, I'm about to play this bitch up real quick, because this, uh, this is getting there. This is done, you feel me? So where, where is, where is the nice bitch, huh? Well, I can go real nice, but I'm gonna go medium nice. Um, which is okay, you know, because it's just me at uh, 1.20 a.m. You know? Uh, I'm gonna have to put you down, I think. Or I can really just stand it up against this, this glass of orange juice. Um, but we're about to really get in there at this spoon. Really get all that extra, this good stuff out of here. And then I'm gonna figure out how to sign into my YouTube app on my phone so I can uh, I can upload upload this for the Mew But Good crew. Cause I care about my fellas, you know. That's how you make. I'm not pretty, I'm very basic carbonara. Um, this is just good, you know what I mean? This is just a good, it's just good, it's good. Okay, so there it is, it's done. It's not, I mean, it could be prettier. I could have plated it a little bit better. Uh, I'm probably gonna add a little bit of extra parmesan on top. But hey, I'm drunk as fuck right now. So the fact that I can even put together a meal, pretty impressive. Oh yeah, and don't let me forget my finishing touch here because I'm a big fan of black pepper. So hold on, I gotta set that up. Oh yeah, where I put this black pepper, huh? Whew. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Some nice stuff right there. Look at that nice carbonara. We in it. <laughs> 